fill the system a little bit. Maybe any excessive carbon monoxide or carbon dioxide, not any excessive. It's very, very clean. And then the heat goes out of this pipe. And this is my favorite part. The pipe goes into a culvert. Now, this is where permaculture comes in. And then the one thing I was going to tell you before we pipe, as you can see, there's also coils of copper tubing that go in there. Yeah. These are, these, no, no. Coils of hex tubing that go in there. Well, it goes up to the egg oil, yeah. And so, there's copper right there. And so they, this PEX tubing here goes in and recirculates the water, so it's heating the water. But the really cool thing is, is that you'd be wasting heat. And everybody always focuses on heating the water. So what, what my buddy Chris did who designed this is he had the, um, the, the pipe go all the way under the greenhouse. You in this culvert, it's buried and it goes all the way through the greenhouse and comes out that stack. And then what he does is he pulls the heat hot air off of this pipe from there from the culvert and he sends it over each grow bed with a little mini hoop house. So that way you're putting the heat where it's needed most and you're heating the water at the same time. That's freaking awesome. That's permaculture. That's all, it's all bio, it's all, it's all bio, it's all bio Back home we call that redneck ingenuity. <laughs>